Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today we continue with chapter 4, Magnetic Field. So in this video, we are going to discuss example 4.6, Talk on a Coin. Okay, so the equations that we will use for this subtopic is Talk. Okay, Talk is equal to N I A cross B, where N is the number of turn, R is the current, A is the cross-sectional area, B is the magnetic field. Okay, or we can write as Talk equals to N I A B, or usually I will write as B now, sine theta. Okay, where the angle theta here is the angle between vector A and also vector B. Okay, so when you want to use vector A, okay, you must draw first. Okay, usually vector A is come up perpendicular from the coin. Okay, so this is our vector A. Okay, you must draw first vector A, okay, come up perpendicular from the coin first. Then only we can determine the angle between vector A and vector B. Okay, so let us try example 10. A 20 turns of rectangular coin with a side of 6 times 4 cm is placed vertically in a uniform horizontal magnetic field of the magnitude of 1 tesla. If the current flow in the coin is 5 ampere, determine the torque acting on the coin when the plane is in perpendicular to the field. Okay, so now the coin is actually perpendicular to the field. Okay, so we can use torque equals to vina sine theta where the angle theta here must be between vector A and also vector B. Okay, so as I mentioned just now, vector A must come up perpendicular from the coin. So this is 90 degree. Okay, so the angle between uh, vector A and B is vector A and vector B. So this is our vector A, this is our vector B. Okay, both of them are actually parallel. So it's equal to vina sine 0 degree. Okay, because vector A and vector B is parallel. Therefore, top for questions number A is equal to 0 Newton meter. Next, questions B. If the coin is parallel to the field. So now coin is parallel to the field. Okay, so when you want to use the equation top equals to Wiener sine theta. Okay, the angle here, you must be careful and you must draw out first the vector A first. Okay, where vector A is always perpendicular to the plane. Okay, so you substitute inside where B here is give you 1 tesla, I is the current, number of turns is 20 and the area is 60m, so we convert it into meter 0 0.06 and 0 0.04 and the angle here is 90 degree yeah, because A is going upward and then B is to the right. Okay, so it's 90 degree, yeah, sine 90 degree is equal to 1. Therefore, top we will get 0 0.24 Newton meter. Okay, so actually this is a maximum top. No? When sine theta equals to 1, meaning that this is actually a maximum top. Okay, okay, see? Okay, when the coin is 60 degree to the field, so this is 60 degree to the field. So we need to draw the uh, vector A first. No? Vector A must perpendicular from the plane. So this is our vector A when it's 90 degree to the plane. Okay, so top here is equal to Vina cos, uh, sorry not cos, sine theta where B is 1, I is 5, N is 20 and the area is 0 0.06 times 0 0.04 and the angle here is between vector A and also vector B. So vector A here, this is our vector A and vector B is uh, to the right. Okay, so this is A and then this is B where the angle between them is actually 30 degree. So it's sine 30 degree. Okay, so if without calculation actually uh, for this part, okay, for this part, actually we know that it's equal to 0 0.24. So you can straight away write 0 0.24 sine 30 degree. Okay, therefore, if you press calculator, we will get 0 0.12 Newton meter. Okay, so remember always you must find out first what is the uh, directions of the vector A. Okay, next we continue with example 11. Okay, again, a rectangular coin of 10 cm times 4 cm in a galvanometer has 50 turns and in a galvanometer has 50 turns and the magnetic flux is 5 exponent negative 2 tesla. The resistance is 40 ohm and the potential difference is 12 volt. It's applied across the galvanometer. Okay, calculate the maximum torque on the coin. Maximum, as I mentioned just now, maximum meaning that sine 90 degree and it must equal to 1. Okay, so now we want to find torque maximum. 
So, top maximum is equal to Vina sine 90 degree. Yeah? Because we know later this one will become 1. So, you substitute B is 5, exponent negative 2. Okay, I is not given. Okay, but we know that they give you the resistor, they give you the potential difference. So, we can use V equals to IR to determine the value for I. Where V is 12 and then R is 40 ohm. Okay, therefore, I is equal to 0 0.3 and So, we substitute inside 0 0.3. Okay, number of turns is 50. Uh, the cross-sectional area is 0 0.1 times 0 0.04. Okay, therefore, the top, the maximum top on the point is equal to 3 times exponent negative 3 Newton meter. Okay, so, okay. So, example 12 is actually out of syllabus, so we will not discuss. Okay, so see you on the next video. Bye.